pleasant day to the enthusiastic learners. It's me, Dr. Shobha Edward, Principal, Associate Professor and Head of the Department of Corporate Secretaryship, KCS Kasinada College of Arts and Science, here to give you a presentation on mode using the grouping and analysis table. So mode is normally found using the formula, but there are times when we have to apply the grouping table and analysis table. So if in the question they want you to do it using the grouping and analysis table, do it using the grouping and analysis table. If not, go ahead with the usual method of finding the mode. And usually the grouping and analysis table is done when the frequency, the highest frequency is, you have similar high frequencies. So, usually mode is stolen by the highest frequency that is there. But when there are nearby similar high frequencies, we go in for a grouping table so that there is no deviation in identifying the mode. So, I will first tell you how the grouping table is done. So, the question 3 to 4, 4 to 5, 5 to 6, 6 to 7, 7 to 8, 8 to 9 and 9 to 10 is written. The frequencies are given. So, first we have to add the frequency in twos. So, these two are added and written. Then these two are added and written in between. The next two are added, written. We don't have two more, so we stop. I repeat. Frequencies are added in twos. You are adding in twos. 25 and 50. 75 and 38. Then we leave the first frequency and add in twos. So this is this. The next column. We leave out 83. We add in twos. So 27 plus 25. 52. 50 plus 75. 125. 38 plus 18. 56. Then the next column, we are going to add the frequency in threes. It's always with the frequency. 83 plus 27 plus 25, 135. 50 plus 75 plus 38, 163. We don't have any more three frequencies. So we stop here. Then the next column, we leave the first frequency and add in threes. 27 plus 25 plus 50. So, 102, 75 plus 38 plus 18, 131. Then the last column, leave out the first frequency and the second frequency. Then add in threes. So, 25 plus 50 plus 75. That is 150. After that, we don't have three frequencies. We stop. So, this is our grouping table. I repeat. First, we add in twos. Then, we leave the first frequency and add in twos. Then, we add in threes. This column is in threes. Then, we leave the first frequency, add in threes. Then, we leave the first two frequencies and add in threes. So, grouping table is over. Now, going on to the analysis table. While going on to the analysis table, first, Write the class intervals and these columns we are going to fill. Take the maximum frequency. Your maximum frequency in this, take the maximum frequency and put a tally mark. So, when you take the maximum frequency, your maximum frequency 83. So, you put a tally mark for that. Then, the maximum in this 113. How did you get 113? 113 was 75 plus 38. So we should put a tally mark for 7 to 8 and 8 to 9. Then in this column, which is the maximum frequency? 125. This was by 50 and 75. So we should put a tally for 6 to 7 and 7 to 8. For 6 to 7 and 7 to 8. Then, here the maximum is 163, but we got three values added. So, we added 50, 75 and 38. 
So we should put a tally for 6 to 7, 7 to 8 and 8 to 9. Here the maximum is 131. And this is got by adding 75, 38 and 18. So we put a tally for 7 to 8, 8 to 9 and 9 to 10. And here the maximum is 150. This is got by adding 25, 50 and 75. So a tally for 5 to 6, 6 to 7 and 7 to 8. So the tally mark is put for all these values. And then the value where the highest tally is. So while counting the tallies, here we have 5 tallies. So your modal class is 7 to 8. So go to your formula again. L plus F minus F1 by 2F minus F1 minus F2 into I. L is 7. We just found out because the frequency is more here. Plus F in the question it is 75 minus F1 before that whatever be the frequency by 2 into F, 2 into 75, minus F1, previous frequency, minus F2, 38, the next frequency. Into I, the class size is 1. 7 to 8 is 1. Solve it and get your answer for the mode as 7.403. So, this is how we do with the grouping table and analysis table. And we will use this method only when they ask us to do using the grouping and analysis table. So for a recap of it, for the grouping table, add the frequency in twos, then leave the first frequency, add the remaining in twos, then add the frequency in threes, leave the first frequency, add the remaining in threes, leave the first two frequencies, Add the remaining in threes, then prepare the analysis table and do the calculation of mode as we always do using the formula L plus F minus F1 by 2F minus F1 minus F2 into I. So, thank you.